Hi everyone, this is Claire and I'm one of the senior functional consultants at Scale North. Today we will be discussing on how to create a standalone invoice in NetSuite. First, what is an invoice? An invoice is a record of sale to a customer. We enter an invoice when payment for goods or services is not received at the time of delivery. I'm currently logged in as an administrator and this is my home dashboard. There are different ways on how you can access the creation of invoice page. First is by going to transactions, sales, create invoices. Another option is by going to this icon right here and then select invoice. The third one, if you are already on a customer record, hover your mouse to this create new icon and then select invoice. If you went on this um, third option, wherein you create an invoice from the customer record, the page will auto-populate the customer field. I'm using the standard product invoice form and you can now enter the information like the date. And if you have an approval process, you can select the approval status as well. For this one, I'll be selecting approved. Enter the other necessary information like the mandatory fields. For this one, location is mandatory. So I'll be selecting Pennsylvania. If you ever viewed all fields on the main header, scroll all the way down and then under item sub tab, select the item. For this one, I'll be selecting this. Enter the quantity. And if you have a custom price, enter the price under the unit price column. Click add. You can, you can enter multiple items in one invoice. There are also other uh, subtabs available like the shipping, billing, accounting. For billing, this is where you can select the term. For example, this invoice is a net 30 invoice. You can enter the net 30 here. And then the due date on the main header will auto calculate based on the term selected under the billing sub tab. If you have reviewed everything under the items, billing, shipping, and other sub tabs, you can click save. Once it's saved, this will be the invoice that will be created with an open status. This is a posting transaction. So it will hit the GL account. You have the available buttons as well, like the authorize return, accept payment, and credit. The other buttons right here are customized button. So this is how you create an invoice in NetSuite. Thanks for watching.